Hi, I'm Coach Charlie from UFC. Today we're gonna start to work in the fundamentals, okay? Fundamentals move for BJJ, which also can be a good uh, workout, okay? It can be a good cardio workout. So we're gonna try to put focus in the in this in the basic moves, okay? So for this session, you need just a kind of yoga mat, okay? And just uh, some space, okay? So we're gonna start from here on my knees to prepare my, my body for the warm up, okay? So I'm just gonna start to go here on this position, four points here, okay? And I'm gonna start first to bring my, my, my butt close to my heels here, okay? Start to stretch my body here. I'm gonna come back here. I'm gonna just draw my chest up. I'm gonna start to come back. Go backward one more time. Start to curl my spine here. Go forward. Chest up. Come back here. Backward. Okay, we're just gonna do this just five times. Chest up. Preparing my body. One more time here. Chest up. And you're gonna come back. Okay, so now from here, I'm gonna start to stretch my arms here. Okay, and I'm gonna start to bring my shoulder to the ground. And you're gonna start to uh, face my hand to the ceiling. Okay, so you're gonna start to go here. One hand on the ground. I'm gonna come back to the other side. Okay, to so start to stretch my shoulder here. I'm gonna do this um, four times each side. Okay, just to prepare my body. Okay, so we're gonna start to go here. Okay, I'm gonna start with my roll forward and backward. Okay, so I'm gonna start to pose my hand here, drop my shoulder, and I'm gonna start to lift my hip up. Okay, so when I lift my hip up, I'm gonna be able always try to control and improve my roll forward. Okay, so from here, I just gonna go backward. I can use my hands, go over my shoulder, try to reach the, uh, the mat with my toes and eventually with my knees. And I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna go to the side. I'm gonna start to squeeze here. I'm gonna start to pass my shoulder, lift my hip up, go forward, use my hands to go backward here, okay? So we're gonna do this again, three, four times uh, forward and backward, okay? To start to give the warm up with my, uh, with my hip, okay? So we're gonna start first um, to refresh the moves, okay? So we're gonna refresh the basic moves. Um, isolate each of them. So eventually we're gonna start to put all together in the drill and we're gonna start to work by time, okay? So the first is gonna be the um, this pro, okay? So we're gonna start from here. So I'm gonna start to stand up here, okay? I'm gonna start to, my strong leg's gonna be backward, my weak leg is gonna be forward here. I'm gonna start to lower my level here without drop my chest here, okay? So from here, I'm just gonna start to pose, pose my hand on the ground here, to stretch my legs, don't bench my, my legs here, it's not a push-up, okay? I'm gonna start to go close with my feet with the ground, and I'm gonna look forward, okay? So from here, the important is how I'm gonna come back, okay? To come back, I'm gonna start to do like a surfer standing, so I'm gonna start to push, and I'm gonna start to come back in the same position here, okay? So I'm gonna go in this direction, so you're gonna see better. I'm gonna start to go here, I'm gonna pose, Pro here and try to bring my hip close to the ground, but it's still with my toes here, okay? Looking forward and come back here on my same my same fine um the same five stance. So the second exercise we're gonna use today is gonna be this this the um break fall, okay? So for the break fall, remember I had to bring my 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 feet in the same line here, bench my knees and start to bring my hip close to the ground, chin in my chest. I'm gonna start to go here. I always my head's gonna be far from the ground, okay? So I always I have to be conscious about this to don't hurt myself, okay? And after that, I'm just gonna try to come back, okay? Without technical stand up, we're just gonna put focus and go up so I can start also to start to bring my legs uh, backward and start to kick with my heels to start to be able to go up again and start my fight stance, okay? So I'm gonna start to go here, sit in the same line, bench, chin in my chest. When I hit, okay, try to open your hands like 45 degrees, not too close, not here, okay, it's not any point. And please never try to pose your hands in that way, okay, otherwise you're gonna hurt your wrist, your shoulder, or your elbow. 
Okay, so we're gonna try to avoid this. So I'm gonna go here, let me down, hit, okay? I can start to go backwards to recover here and keep my five stance, okay? This is my break fall. So, and the last exercise for this plug, okay? It's gonna be the, actually it's gonna be uh, two moves, which is one is gonna be technical standard and the other is gonna be full guard, okay? I know this is very basic, but with this, that's the fundamentals, okay? So we always, we're gonna come back to this exercise, no matter what, if you are a wide belt beginner, or in my case, um, I still using these moves all the time in the all rows, okay? So we're gonna start with the technical standard, okay? So from here, I'm gonna just choose one foot, okay? I'm gonna bring the foot close to my hip here, and my opposite hand is gonna be in the ground, okay, guys? So remember always this, because most of the people, they feel confused about this, if I go on the same side, always it's gonna be a balance here, okay? So I'm gonna start to go in the opposite, okay? So I have my two base here, one in my foot, one in my hand. So after that, I'm gonna start to bring my hip up to create a space to pass my leg and bring my hand, my foot close to my hand here, okay? And after that, I'm gonna start to go with my weight forward here on that leg, okay? To come back, it's gonna be pretty much the same, remember? First, I'm gonna pose my hand forward, okay? I'm gonna try to create like a kind of triangle when I go here, so my hand's gonna go there. It's not gonna be too close to my foot, it's not gonna be backward. It's gonna start to go here, okay? So after that, from there, I'm gonna do the same move. I'm gonna bring the leg, and I'm gonna kick forward. So I'm gonna sit again. Go to the other side, kick, start to go with my hip up, step, go here, pose, and kick forward, okay? I'm gonna do this position so you're gonna see better so i'm gonna start to go here one always my hand is gonna protect my face here hip up I start to try to lift my hip to create a space to pass my leg under and start to step backward okay i cannot step in the same line otherwise always i'm gonna be on balance balance here so i'm gonna start to always got this distance between my legs okay so now we are using the three moves uh the four moves sorry Sprawl, break fall, technical standard, and pull guard. So we're gonna start to put this in the in the drill. Okay, so we're gonna do this just for two minutes. Okay, you're gonna do it with me. And also we're gonna start to improve and uh, and how link the the drills. Okay, and in the side and the five stands too. Sorry. So we're gonna start from here, from my five stands. Okay. So when when you're gonna be ready. We just gonna start to move here, okay? I'm gonna always gonna give my five stands. Remember, if I move my foot, uh, if I go to that side, I have to move this foot first, and this is gonna fall, okay? Never I can cross my legs here. If I go forward, backwards, that's gonna be a mess if this happens in the, the, the sparring, okay? So first, I just gonna start to move around, okay? Of course, that's gonna be depend about how how big is my space. But I'm gonna start to go here, okay? So I'm gonna start to go there. I'm gonna start to move here to one side, to the other side, I'm gonna start to move forward here, I'm gonna start to move backward here, and wait, I'm gonna do pro, and I'm gonna come back, and I'm gonna go to the other side, break fall. Okay, when I go up, when you say break fall, just break fall, it's just gonna go up, and that way here, okay? If I say break fall, and then it goes stand up, I'm gonna come back here, okay? If I say pull guard, just gonna go there, and you're gonna start to go here, okay guys? So I'm gonna start to go here, I'm gonna start to move, and I'm gonna do this pro, okay? I'm gonna come back, break four. Go up, pro. Break four. Then you go stand up. Start to move, keep moving. Spro. Change the direction. Break four. Then you stand up, move guard. Then you stand up. See, now I change my leg. So I start to go here, pro. Five stands. To the other side, break four. And we're gonna finish here, okay guys? So, as you see, that's a very good workout. The intensity is gonna be, it's gonna depend on um, of you, how often you want to do the pro break four, but it's very good for the cardio, okay? So that's gonna be the first part of the of the drills. Okay, and now we're gonna start to put focus on the um, drills on the ground. Okay, so 
one of the first drills that we are, we're gonna uh, we're gonna do is the hip escape. Okay, so this is the, the the normal hip escape. So I'm gonna start from here. I'm gonna bring always my heels close to my butt here. Okay, if I start to go here, it's gonna be very hard for me to do any exercise in the ground. So I'm gonna start to go here. I'm gonna I will always I'm gonna keep my hands here. Try to frame, try to pose him, okay? So now, I'm just gonna start doing this. I, I'm gonna choose this leg, okay? So I'm gonna start to put my weight on my shoulder here, and I'm gonna start to shift my hip here, like I try to like I try to reach my toes with my fingers, okay? And after that, I'm gonna come back forward. I'm gonna start to bring my leg forward, and I'm gonna keep my back flat on the ground. So on the other side is the same. I'm gonna put my back on the side. I'm gonna try to touch here, okay? I'm gonna come back. And you're gonna finish here. So one more time. Okay, guys. When you start to go here, try to bring your hip um, on the same line in your head. Okay. Try to go finish in that position here. And you're gonna come back forward. You're gonna start to go. We're gonna do this ten times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine and ten. Perfect. So one of the exercises also this is very important is the bridge. Okay, so first I just gonna start to to bridge up. Okay, so I'm gonna keep my hands on the ground here. And I just gonna do this try to stretch my hip here, okay, as much as you can. And you're gonna come back. Okay, just ten times. So hands on the ground and go. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, guys. So always I'm gonna try to go with my hip as high as I can. Okay. So now we're gonna do something similar, but we're gonna start to put the weight in just one shoulder, and I'm gonna try to touch with my other hand as far as I can, okay? So I'm gonna start to go to one side. So I'm gonna start to bridge here, okay? My weight is on one shoulder, and I'm gonna try to touch as far as I can. Then I'm gonna come back to the middle again. And I'm gonna go to the other side here. I'm gonna touch, you see my feet is as high as it's possible. And I'm just gonna come back. Go up, and come back. Go up, and come back. Go up, and come back. Okay, so we're gonna do this 10 times again. Okay, so we're gonna start. One, two, three, four. Focus on your hip. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, guys. So one other important exercise from here is how to connect this with torture position, okay? So we're gonna start from here, okay? And we're gonna start to bridge, but now I'm gonna start to do this. I'm gonna start to pass my arm under my body here, okay? And I'm gonna start to bridge my knee to the other side here, okay? So I'm gonna start to go here. I am pushing with my hip, and I'm gonna start to bring my knee. And I'm just gonna finish in this position, which is if it's familiar for you, yeah, it's torto position, okay? So I have to, on torto, I am here, I open my knees a bit, and I keep my elbows inside, okay? So now from here, we're gonna just start, stretch my hand, stretch my leg, start to slice my leg forward, and to keep my back flat on the ground here, okay? And I'm gonna start to go to the other side. So I'm gonna start from here, I'm gonna bridge up, okay? I'm gonna start to pass the arm under my body here, and I'm gonna start to bring my knee, one and two, okay? The important is finishing the very strong base here. I'm gonna go there, stretch, hand, leg, so slice my leg forward, and finish here, okay? So we're gonna do this again, five times each side, okay? So we're gonna start from here, and go, one, two, Three, four, five, six, 
five. Six. Seven. Nine and ten. Okay, guys. So, most of the time when we are doing this kind of exercise, okay, we most most of the time we do this together, okay. This is the the basic exercise to start the skate and side control, which is um. It's always important to refresh, okay, and how to be conscious about what I am, if I am doing the exercise right, okay? So, now, we're going to start to doing this too, okay? I want to see you guys doing the hip escape. Uh, sorry, you're going to do bridge and hip escape now. You're going to start to combine two exercises, okay? So, you're going to start to go here. I'm going to start to bridge first, okay? And after bridge, I'm going to keep one foot. And you're gonna go back over here, okay? And you're gonna come back. So before we was just moving here, now you are breaching and you go for the hip escape, okay? So breach and come back here. Now I'm gonna try to bring my my knee close to my elbow here, okay? To try to create like a kind of shield, okay? So when this is when we're gonna start to recover the the close guard, okay, from the side control. So we're gonna do this same times again. So I'm gonna start to go here. I'm gonna start to bridge and bring my elbow close to my knee, okay? I'm gonna start to put my body on the side here and I'm just gonna come back to the middle here. And I go to the other side, bridge, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Cool, guys. So, also you gonna work. You gonna feel you're working a lot the hip and the core. Okay. So now, just one more exercise I want to see you guys doing. Okay. So we're gonna start to do like. Kind of hip escape, you can go hip escape too. Um, we're gonna start to use my same leg, okay? So before I was moving in that way, I was take, starting from here, I was using my leg and I was shifting my hip here, okay? So now I'm gonna just use my foot on the same spot here, okay? So I'm gonna start from here and I'm gonna start to go backward and now I'm gonna start to go forward, shifting my hip come back to the middle. So I'm gonna start to go here, lean down my way to one side, shift, and come back. Shift, and come back. So you always are gonna try to go with my back flat on the ground again. Okay, we start. One, to the other side. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Perfect. So now I'm going to start from this position, okay? And we're going to do one more time the technical standard, but now I want to see you guys doing from this position, okay? The EM. The end is gonna be the same, but I'm gonna change something to start. Okay, before we were starting already seat there. So now we're gonna start from here. I'm gonna choose one side here, okay? I'm gonna start to open my elbow here, okay? And I'm gonna start to go up, okay? So I have my base here. So now I'm gonna start to lean my way forward. So now I can start to pose my hand. And now I'm gonna finish here. I'm gonna pose my hand forward. I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna go to the other side. Okay, so first 
I'm gonna do in this direction so you can see better. Okay, so first I'm gonna start to choose one side here. Okay, so I'm gonna start to open my elbow here, and you're gonna start to go up just on my elbow and using my forearm here. Okay, so now third, I'm gonna start to kick forward, and now when I start to kick forward here, I have the space to pose my hand. So from there, I'm just gonna create the space and go here my five cents. We're gonna pose my hand forward. And you're gonna come up, okay? So we're gonna do this again five times each side, okay? So we're gonna start from here, and we're gonna start one open kick up. Finish when I fin finish when like he's just gonna finish when I come back again with my five flat on the ground. Two. And ten. Okay, guys. So now you're gonna start to work on one exercise, which is gonna be free tough for the for the abs. Okay. So, but also is gonna give us a good core. Okay. So the idea. I'm gonna start from here, okay? I'm just gonna start to keep my legs here up, okay? I'm gonna use my elbows here, okay? And I'm gonna just start to move side to side, okay? I don't need big space. So I'm just gonna start to go here, keep my legs up, use my elbows, so you don't use too much your hands. And you're gonna start to go here, to one side, just to go to here, see? I am trying to open my knees here, but my legs, they are, they're still alive, okay? My legs they are not just here and moving, okay? My legs is here. You see my toes, they are active now. I have my, my shins here ready, okay? So start to move here. And I'm just gonna start to move to one side, okay? And I'm gonna switch to the other side for 30 seconds, okay? I'm gonna start to go here. See, I'm lifting my hip and I am moving. I go to the other side and I start to use my elbows to start to move my hip here. And time. Okay, guys. So you're going to feel your abs like very burning. Okay, so we're going to start with the last part. Okay, so we're going to start to developing the, the skills for how to move my hip. Okay, and the end we're going to do just the uh, exercise. Okay, to keep the the core strong, okay, which is very important in jiu-jitsu, okay? So now, I'm just gonna do this exercise from here, okay? I'm gonna start first, uh, have a nice space here, okay? And I'm gonna start with my legs. I'm gonna just start just to kick up, okay? I'm gonna start to lift my hip uh, far from the ground, okay? It's, it's not about just doing this, okay? I want to see like very a nice red line, and I'm gonna start to go up, okay, so I'm gonna start to go here, and you're gonna start to go in that way, okay? I'm gonna do just 10, ready, and go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Okay, guys, so now we're gonna start to connect with other exercise for the for the abs, and now we're gonna start to connect with uh, a specific exercise for Jiu Jitsu, okay? So now I'm gonna just start to go here, okay? Okay, with this, everybody knows these abs, okay? Everybody hates these abs too. So now we're gonna start to go here, 
bring the legs, and then kick up. Stop there, bring the legs down, up, kick. Okay, I don't wanna use the move just to go here and kick, okay? It's two separate moves that I'm just connecting, okay? So I'm gonna start to go here, legs up, stop there, up, come back. Go with the leg down, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, guys, so now that's the important part, okay? Everybody heard before about triangle, okay? But um, sometimes you don't remember where you have, how can I set up the triangle, okay? Okay, guys, so we're gonna start to refresh how to set up the triangle, okay? So that's gonna be the first exercise. Of course, I have to try to open my knee uh, outside, okay? To, to have a better angle to start to bring here and lock my leg, okay? When I start to go here, that should be always strong, okay? If I keep my leg here, that's in the fight, it's gonna slice here and I'm gonna lose the position. So that's the way I'm gonna set up. So I'm gonna just start to go here and change. See how I'm changing my hip too? I'm changing my hip here and go to one side. I can use my hands in the beginning if I win, if I want, and change, okay? So I'm just gonna start to go there. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so now we're just gonna start to connect both exercise. Okay, and we're gonna finish with this. We're just gonna start to go up and set up the triangle in the air. Okay, so I'm gonna start from here. I'm gonna kick up and set up the triangle. Kick up, kick up, set up here. Okay, if I can twist my hip, it's much better. Okay. But the idea for me is just remain, remember this, okay? So let's start. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, guys, so now we refresh the, the positions, okay? We refresh the basic things, okay, the fundamentals. And also we did a good uh, workout, okay? The important with this, you're going to learn the techniques that you can connect um, the way that you want. And you can start to put intensity on your workout, okay? If you want to put more aerobic, you can do more aerobic. If you want to uh, work more um, core, you, can, you know how to do it because all the exercise, you're gonna feel when you are working, okay? You're gonna be able to start to connect just the, the, the exercise, the moves, to create your own workout for your, for your necessity, okay? Also, please give us the feedback from this video and below in the comments. Thank you.